You have a very extrovert stage act by any standards. Will you... You mean I flaunt it? You're over the top. Freddie, of course, was the flavor of the time. With Bohemian Rhapsody, it was basically I was writing three songs. Um, I just couldn't finish them, and I just put the three together. What, what earth do they think they're doing? I was the idiot who said, why, why don't we ask them to do an edit? Each song that we do has a different sort of uh, meaning to it. So, I mean, you know, it is rock and roll as a sort of label. It's Freddie's morbid mind, <laughs> <laughs> I think he was always looking for perfection, which is probably a harder thing to find. And I just felt at that moment, we're going to lose Fred. Very few people who were Freddie Mercury fans know he was Farrakh Bulsara. And being Freddie Mercury allowed Farrakh to be that person. You think, well, what would, you know, what would Freddie be doing now? <laughs> <laughs>